Yo, rise and shine. It's your girl Joy checking in. Hey, I heard April was uh, poetry month. So I wrote this bit a couple weekends ago. It goes like this. It's called The Last Hour of Darkness. There was but a sliver of the moon. I had to squint and look far to see the twinkle in the stars. Yet there was light on the waves that would crash the seawall soon. The breeze at my back pushed me forward and took away the sound. Sea creatures, Tito and I, were the only sentient beings around. We jogged ahead to put our feet in the sand and count the sea sponges whose lives went unplanned. As I turned ahead in the other direction, the ocean spray kissed my skin, and I thought for one to have never felt that sensation should be a deadly sin. Now the sliver of the moon pulled the last of the darkness away and brought in a golden hue to announce the new day. I knew then that I struggled to get the words just right as I tried to describe what I wish you'd seen with your own sight. Cause I know you would have credited the universe with the gift, but it wasn't meant to be if only for a cosmic shift. So instead, accept this lyric as one from me. What? Ha, <laughs> you didn't know I could do it like that. Believe that, that's the last hour of darkness. It's April, it's poetry month. When we are take time to be creative, we're most present. And in times like this, when we don't know what's coming tomorrow, the only thing you could do is be here now. So go ahead and get your piece of paper and a pencil and write something and share it with me. You know I'm crazy about you. Peace.